Why did you decide to leave business temporarily to study liberal arts and pursue a master's degree at Dartmouth? As an undergrad, I studied finance. I went straight into investment banking. Um, I worked in finance after that for a while. And there was something about the business world that wasn't completely fulfilling me, and I couldn't put my finger on it. And um, this is so hokey, but I actually, I did a personality test, <laughs> and um, I, I, I love the Myers-Briggs, and I did, a, I did a personality test, and I was trying to figure out, all my friends were going to business school, a few years out of, out of you work in, you do investment banking especially, and it's like a two-year program, it's a feeder into business school. And I was, you know, I could have filled out the application, and I, I could have just gone, but I felt like something was missing. And so I was doing all these personality tests and trying to figure out what is it that's missing. And um, oddly enough, the personality tests were, set, you know, I, I found what I really, what really resonated for me. And a lot of the people with their careers were completely different. They were in psycho they were psychologists, they were writers, they were, there was something creative about what they were doing. Or it was something based off of people. And a lot of the finance I was doing didn't have that whole element of people and relationships and understanding. And I knew that had to be integrated into my business world. I, I had a sense I was going to business school afterwards, but I wanted the option to say, let me explore what I'm doing. Let me explore this liberal arts that I looked into. And if it ends up I go to business school afterwards, great. If it ends up I have this completely different career and I find this dream, you know, that's great too.